this is Corey Bauer with Go Engineer, and this video is to show how to set up a topology study within SOLIDWORKS. We go to the simulation menu, and then we create a new study, and we've got a couple different uh, groups of study types, and we want to come down to the second group, the design insight, and we're going to pick a topology study. Uh, we can name the study whatever we want, and then we'll hit OK. The first few items within the topology study are identical to a linear static stress analysis. So we apply the material, we apply the fixtures, and we apply the loads. So we're just going to right click on the material, and we're just going to pick the alloy steel from within the SOLIDWORKS library. And for our fixtures, we're going to add a fixed restraint on both of these faces. And then we're going to apply our load over on the lug side of the bracket. Okay. And we're just going to apply a thousand pounds. Now the next step is to set up the topology portion of the study. And that is done through two different areas, uh, the goals and constraints, and then the manufacturing controls. So when we right click on goals and constraints, we have a couple different options on what we want to optimize on. So we've got the best stiffness to weight ratio. We've got a minimum or maximum displacement that we can define. And we can also minimize the mass with a certain displacement uh, constraint. So we're going to go with the best stiffness to weight ratio. And it's asking us how much weight we want to reduce by percentage. Okay, so defaults to 30%, which is a good uh, amount. Uh, we can look at the other options while we're here. We can minimize or maximize the displacement. Okay, so then we just pick an area on the model that we want to measure, and then we reduce um, mass by that. Okay, and then the same type of thing here where we want to minimize the mass with the displacement requirement. So best stiffness to weight ratio is what we're going to use. Now the next thing we can control is any area in the model that we want left unchanged. And typically that is around the uh, fixtures and around the load. So we're going to add a preserve region. And you start by picking a face or multiple faces if it's the same depth. And then we can say... I want to go from that face into the model a certain amount and we want to turn on our preview. Okay, So you can see it just takes that at face and extends it into the model. Uh, for us two inches is exactly what we want and we want to apply another preserve region so we'll go ahead and use the push pin to keep the menu open and on this one we want to use the face on the lug And in this case, six inches gives us the depth that we want. So we'll hit the green check to OK that. And then we'll get out of that menu. Okay. If we wanted to do some manufacturing uh, controls, we can either define it as a cast part. And we define the direction of pull, whether it's one direction, two directions, or uh, mid-plane. But in our case, we're not going to do that. Another option would be we could specify a symmetry plane. Okay. In our case, we want it to be the same top to bottom, so that would be half symmetry. And because of the way we modeled it, the front plane slices the model where we want. Okay. So it's going to apply half symmetry about that plane. And just like a linear static analysis, we can mesh and run. Once the analysis is done running, uh, we get a preview of what the optimized shape is going to look like, but we have a couple different options. So if we go into the result um, and edit definition, first thing we have is a slider controlling how much mass is retained or removed within the design. So we can slide it left to right. 
we're going to go somewhere right in the middle. And then the next thing we're going to do is the option of creating the smooth mesh. And this gets us closer to a CAD model that we could use directly. Okay, so that gives us a nice smooth shape. and then we'll hit OK. And then from there we can even export the smooth mesh out into a new configuration uh, or a new part file. Okay. So that is the setup of a topology study. Mm -hmm.